Come on, Jesse. All right, come on. Come on now. Come over this way. There you go. Don't be afraid. Come on. Go on, Jesse. It's all right. Go on, sweetheart. All right, girls. Oh, hi. Hi, I'm Patty Pepper, and this is my husband, Harlan. Uh, now, who do we have here? Well, this is Jesse, and this is baby Jason, Julie, Susie, and Cindy. Well, aren't you a bunch of cuties? You must be exhausted. Are, are you hungry? I'll bet you are. What a little dreamboat here. Why don't you let me take him for you? It's okay. I can do it. Well, what are we standing around talking for? Come in. Come in. Come on, girls. Wait till you see your bedrooms. I think you'll like them. But hey, you must be starving. Yep. Well, don't be shy. Everybody around here loves to eat. Go on, girls. Go on, Jesse. Go on, girls. Go on. Go on. Here we go. Jesse, <clears throat> what do you think? This is the way they like them? Here, try one. I guess they're okay. And something to drink. I don't like jelly. Well, here. Peanut butter, peanut butter, peanut butter, peanut butter. About just peanut butter. Oh, Harley, I forgot to pick up a bottle when I was at the store. I have one. Well, aren't you a good mother? But you want to wash it up? Thanks. Lucky, aren't we? You work? Sure, doesn't everybody? Ray never did. Who's Ray? He lived with us, but he didn't do nothing except maybe hit us. Oh, it's terrible. Jesse told him where to go, didn't you, Jesse? I, I wondered. Could you walk me to the car? Sure. Thanks, honey. Uh huh. What do you do? Well, I'm a farmer. I raise some sheep and some pigs. <coughs> you girls wouldn't want to help me feed them, would you? <coughs> well, I could use your help. <coughs> I really appreciate you taking on five kids. That was no problem. I love kids. I mean, the minute I saw those darling little pumpkins, my heart just went out to them. So how's her mother? And she's in the psychiatric unit at Holy Family, but she committed herself, so we'll just have to wait and see. But what if she doesn't get better? Well, let's hope for the kids' sake she does. And if she doesn't? I know what you're thinking. Well, I mean, could we adopt them? Can foster parents do that if things don't work out? Anything's possible, but you can't be thinking like that now. I'll drop in on you tomorrow. See how things are going, okay? 
We'll try to set up a time for the kids to visit their mother as soon as possible. In the hospital, you think that's wise? Well, you leave the case plan to me. Sure. <laughs> of course. Gee, thanks, Donna. <laughs> Let's see if you thank me in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> You're so nice. They get paid to be nice. They don't really mean it. <laughs> The bubble bath. Anytime you want, pumpkin. What, mommy? She's um, she's a little sick, and when she gets better, we'll go see her. You promise? I promise. You say your prayers? No, I don't believe in God. How come? Jesse says he's mean. But he made you, and you're perfect. I like you. I like you too, Susie. get paid for us? Of course. You don't think they do it for free, do you? What do you think Mom is thinking right now? How should I know? You can ask her when we get back home. You miss her? I guess so. Jesse? Maybe Jason could stay with Harlan and me tonight. Why? Well, if he wakes up for his milk or something, I could... It needs me to do it. Besides, he'd just make a fuss if he tried to. Sure. Okay. Well, night. You ready? Do we have to? This bed is nice. We have to stick together. We're a family. Come on, I promised. Sweetheart, you know that's not true. Then let me show you something. Huh? Look at these legs. Those are the legs of a cheerleader. And these arms. Those arms are perfect to hold somebody real close someday. And this face, this beautiful face, from now on, I think I'm just gonna have to call you Miss America. Would that be okay? Come on, man. <laughs> 